common and that is that we are very thrifty. Mine is more so on the side of furniture and clothes and shoes. Him, on the other hand, <laughs> um, farm equipment, tools, things of, of that, uh, that nature. So today he was scrolling through Craigslist and he happened to stumble upon this what would you seed, call it? Seed starting equipment <laughs> ad that this guy was trying to sell. A seed starting equipment ad. And it had like a couple pictures and it was only a hundred bucks. But what sold us were two seed starting mats, which are pretty expensive. Um, when you're trying mats. to, yeah, sorry, heat mats. And, and the lights. And lights, grow lights, which can be pretty pricey as well if you get like really nice ones. And we were like, you know what? Yeah, we we want this. <laughs> like, yeah. We've got a hundred bucks to put towards this, so like, we're gonna go pick it up. This is just one box. There are there's two more boxes, the lights, and a wooden stand. It's like really heavy duty, like solid wood. Yeah. So three three levels on the on the wood stand, and it came with six fluorescent grow lights <laughs> and the box is full of seeds and seeds yeah tons of seeds which he stated like in the ad some of them may be older and may not germinate but so be it i mean the, the lights and the mat alone are well over a hundred dollars worth of value mm -hmm. add so, in the, the shelves the shelving rack and all the seeds Yeah, I was telling Levi, like, I feel like a kid on Christmas, Christmas Eve, <laughs> just the adult version, our Craigslist haul. We'll show you guys everything when we get home, though. Alright, so we're finally home and Harper's in bed, so I figured I'd show you guys some more of, like, what we just got. This whole huge, huge tub full of plant trays and lids. And also, this is the plant rack that I was talking about. So it's solid wood and um, it already has like the little notches for the grow lights to go on it. So that's pretty fun, pretty cool. We're gonna put that in the basement. Also, there's Biscuit and Ellie. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the stuff now. Okay, so I'm still trying to figure out where lights are in the front of the house. There we go. All right, so we also got two of these big seedling heat mats. They gave us all of the surge protectors and like timers. Then this is the box that I'm like stoked to open up. So I'm going to take that onto the back porch and go through it here in a minute. And then here are the six grow lights. Okay. Um, so change of plans. I'm actually just doing it in our dining, like formal dining room that isn't a formal dining room yet. But, okay. They have a ton of just random seeds. I'll have to ID what these are. I don't know them off the top of my head. This one looks familiar, but I can't place it yet. I think those might be cattails. These, I don't, <laughs> I don't even know what they are, but they're so stinking cute. I just can't even. Um, they're called Wormy the Water Sensor Tagalongs. Um, I cannot wait for Mila to see these. <laughs> like, what is this? I don't know, but it's precious. They're made out of like clay or something. <sighs> they're so stinking cute. <laughs> There's like a almost full box of those. Now the fun part. So lots of seeds. As I mentioned earlier in the video, some of them are um, older so the, and they might even be empty and they might not germinate, but whatever, like this is so cool. Um, yeah, sorry, I'm just looking through all of them. Of course I already got into it when we got home. I was like, I have to see what's in here. And also like, the guy made these cool little bins, like, with scrap pieces of wood and stuff, and they're so cute. So, there's those two. 
There's another one with some little stakes. Put those on top of each other. There's some, um, those are like the little uh, soil blocks that I think I saw plastic trays for. Here's another. So marigolds. All sorts of flowers. Very cool. What else do we have down in here? Okay, another one of these little trays. Some tulip bulbs. These are some herbs. What's that one? I don't know, but it looks pretty cool. Waldman's dark green lettuce. We haven't planted that lettuce before. This is the little container I was going for. Cool little stainless steel like utensil container. This will be perfect for out in the greenhouse. Some steaks. Um neat. Neato. More of those seeds. What the heck are these? <laughs> I feel like I know. Those actually, those are different than those, but similar. They don't have, they're not labeled, but I'm going to ID them. I feel like I should know what they are. Oh, cool. Sorry, guys. This is just exciting. Rooting hormone. And a bunch of steaks. This guy is awesome. Score, like this is Christmas day. Literally Christmas day. I don't know what that is, but. There's some seat pack things. Another bag of mystery something. I'm not sure what that is, but. The root ball to something. Um. <laughs> a little trowel, some more loose seeds, seed potatoes, extension cords, another thing of, I don't know what's in here, but we're going to find out. Some more seeds. I can tell there's seeds in here. It feels like, I don't know what, but maybe just dirt. I don't know. There's something in there. Yeah, a cute little basket. This looks like it has labels in it for other things that maybe they had planted. Here's the pot maker that I saw in the picture online on the Craigslist ad. I was trying to explain it to Levi, but... We have a soil blocker, but this is kind of similar. It's a pot maker. So you take newspaper and I don't know if you can see the picture, the images. Yeah, yeah we'll have to try that out. That's pretty nifty. Some more brand new steaks. I mean, labels, not steaks. Some more of those little soil blocks. Black hollyhock seeds, deep red hollyhock seeds, cool, <laughs> what do you think? Oh, like a <laughs> treasure trove of random stuff. Yeah, I showed them the lights and the mat and the shelving unit. So wow. that's a lot of stuff. Um, I can really order tons of seeds. Yeah. You deep in thought. Sorry, I was reading. Reading like these seeds are from 2015, but like they might germinate. We're gonna plant them and just try them out. Why not? Oh. <laughs>
<laughs> looks like something <laughs> off like a scary movie. <laughs> but here is the shelving unit. Levi put it together. It has a thermometer. It has these little links so that you can move the grow lights up as the plants get bigger. We're pretty excited. I'm foreseeing like a nice microgreen growing system right here. Mm -hmm. Where we can control the control the temperature a little better. <laughs> what do you think, Harvey? <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> so we got all of that stuff for $100. And it may not seem like a lot to some people, but those in the gardening world, it's, it's a lot. There's so many seeds. We ended up sorting them last night and there's over like 300 seed packets and varieties and just things that he had collected and was getting rid of. So if you're ever looking or not looking, um, just keep an eye on Craigslist, on Facebook Marketplace, and sometimes you can even get stuff for free where people are just like, I want this gone. Like, please take it off my hands. But we hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and get ready for our upcoming strawberry video. Chance on.